Hi guys, welcome to this week's video. Today I'm going to do a what's on my iPhone because I haven't done one in literally nearly two years. And last one was when I first got my iPhone 6 Plus. So it's about time I showed you what's on my iPhone 7 Plus. And this one is a rose gold and it's got a cute little peach case from Skinny Dick London. This is actually, I think, nearly sold out now. I will link it in the description below if you want to try and find that case for your phone. But this was the last one that I managed to pick up from the Comic Garden store. And yeah, it's just so pretty. And I just think it really complements the rose gold as well. Plus, you've got the classic double camera that comes with 7 Plus. So you can do like two, I think it's portrait mode you can do, which is really good. It looks like it's taken on the proper camera and I just really love it. I might show you an example if I've got one in my camera roll. But anyway, if you want to see what's on my iPhone 7 Plus, then carry watching. So this is my iPhone 7 Plus. And as you click on there, I've got pink palm leaves, which are super, super cute. And on my home screen, of course, is the palm leaves again. So on the home screen, at the top, I've got calendar, photos, camera, and Instagram. And the photos are so good quality. I'll show you the portrait mode. So this is a portrait mode and it really sort of blurs out the background and it's so cool. I actually really love it. And camera of course is your standard and Instagram. Obviously please go and follow me. This is my theme at the moment. It's looking very, very snazzy and I'm actually in love with it. I just love looking at all the pictures that people post as well. And I follow some really cool bloggers so definitely check it out, oh my god, pugs, yes. And if we go back, the next row is lifestyle, games and entertainment. So in lifestyle, I've got clock, iChain store, calculator, app store, weather, messenger, bitmoji, which is part of Snapchat, boots at Starbucks, Buzzfeed, Lush and Goodreads. So the my most used ones in here are probably boots to check how many points I've got, Starbucks to check how much money I've got on my card, Buzzfeed, to take those quizzes that they like to post, like find out how much of a hipster you actually are. Blush app I use to check ingredients for reviews on the products that I'm doing for my Lush Instagram. And then Goodreads is like sort of a book tracker to see how many books I can read in a year. Then Games is actually just Best Fiends, Subway, Temporon 2, Pokemon Go, Lego, Harry Potter, Cooking Fever, Candy Crush, some Llama game and Sonic Dash. I don't really play games, but when I'm really bored, I tend to go for these. And Pokemon Go isn't as much of an obsession as it used to be, but it's still really good. And my favorite game ever is probably Candy Crush, which is really sad because it's so old, but it's just one of those sort of boredom buster things I like doing. Entertainment is basically just Netflix, BBC iPlayer, BT Wi-Fi, all four ITV Hub and the BGT app, which I only use to vote in the semi-finals for people I like. And Netflix, I mainly use to watch like Girl Boss and Pretty Little Liars. And then I got Bisco Cam, which you, I use to edit my Instagram photos and my YouTube thumbnails. If you want to see how I edit my Instagram photos, and then do comment below and I'll do a video on that. And then Unnum is really good free app because you can plan your Instagram feed. So, whoops, you can move photos around and all that. And oh my god, it's not moving, but you get it. So that's how my Instagram has been on point recently. So I definitely recommend it, but it only works online. So you need Wi-Fi or data to use this. Then I got Calm, which is for meditation and you have like sounds that you can meditate to my favorite is this one and this one and i also really like thunderstorms and then you've got notes one second every day which i haven't been doing really well with this is basically may the rest of the year is actually on my computer because i couldn't import the videos from my other phone so I had to 
sort of continue in the app. Twitter, go and follow me as well. I like to tweet a lot, share my blog posts, videos, and yeah, I just really love this app. It's one of my favorite social media apps ever, especially when talking to other bloggers. So I'm all about having the theme on the head or an icon. And as you can see, it's a 1975 reference. Then I've got YouTube, which I am religiously using to catch up on subscriptions. And these are all my subscriptions if you're being a bit nosy. And this is my channel. My channel has grown seriously a lot since I last filmed this, so if you want to check it out, then obviously you're watching it. So YouTube Inception, and these are all my videos. Then I've got Pinterest, which I'm obsessed with. And these are all my pins and I just really love the app and everything has to be aesthetically pleasing for me so that's why a lot of these look really quite clean there's also a lot of unhealthy food then you've got blog loving which I use to catch up on posts look I've got loads of new posts to read and I sort of check how many people are reading my blog posts there's a hack you can do if you're a blogger you can just put a read more so people have to click on it because blog loving takes your blog post views. Tumblr, Snapchat, Facebook, Chrome, followers. This is really good to see what people follow you, what people unfollow you, so you can unfollow them as well. WhatsApp, we heart it, and settings. And then here is basically all the unwanted ones, like you'll know. Then we've got Editing, the Superimpose, Eraser and Fonto. These are really good for creating thumbnails and all that. And Fonto is really good for fonts. I religiously use this again for my YouTube thumbnails and of course at the bottom is messages, phone, mail and music. And this is all the albums and playlists that I've made recently. And as you can see, I've been obsessed with Paramore. It is the best album ever. And that is basically my iPhone. Not much on there, but I'm really happy with it. And I'll probably add more apps over the coming months or days or whatever. But yeah, yay. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and click the notification bell below to get up to when next upload. I don't ever tell you this, but I upload every Friday and I hope you guys have an amazing weekend and I'll see you next week. Bye! Oh,